back to the channel. It is me, Alana, and we're going to be watching episode three of The Boys. The last episode, we saw Huey actually pressing the button, which made the bomb that was in Translucent's ass blow up. So he's dead. He's gone, okay? Um, the, the plan that Butcher and Frenchie had about blowing up the building, I was wondering why they were doing that. It was just to distract Homelander. So that actually worked. They were this close of getting found out. So that's where we are. I don't know where we're gonna go from here. I don't know if Homelander's gonna hear the other um, explosion and try to run to see what is happening. Or is he just so caught up in the first explosion to where he's not going to notice this one? Because this one would be smaller on scale compared to, of course, the building catching on fire. So we will see about that. We also saw how, I forget the woman's name, who was milking herself, uh, pumping milk, and um, kind of like pulling strings, uh, blackmailing folks, having this, what's the name, doppelganger, acting like a woman and humping the senator. And it, it, this show is freaking wild, okay? Again, like I said before, I remember turning this on but I wasn't really watching, apparently, like I should have been, because this show is absolutely bonkers, okay? There's things that, like, I I just can't even, like, mentally grasp, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, but let's just go ahead and jump onto episode three of The Boys. Let's go. Oh. Oh, it's covering up his skin. He actually killed a person. I guess now he's going to understand what Frenchie was saying, how your first person you kill is like a scar. This is going to be his first scar. So I guess it didn't alert Homelander. They're going to have to burn this place down. He still got blood. Look, I'd be damned but I'm taking a shower to get everything off me, and I still got shit on me. He probably can. He's probably trying to like be busy so he doesn't have to think about what's happening. Wait, you'll go. Come on home. New clothes. We'll get you clothes. I want my clothes. Oh. Frenchie goes with you. Wait, what? No. Either he goes with you or Frenchie leaves. Let's go, mon ami. <laughs> Frank, you think he knows one thing, huh? What are you gonna switch if Homelander's not back? What is he doing? He's gonna blow it up. I said to blow the shit up. I said it. I said I was. There's no blood was everywhere. What is what? What y'all doing? <laughs> what is she visiting Stillwell for? Come on in. Oh, that's right. The ten o'clock meeting because of her beating up those dudes. She saw that video on YouTube and she came forward to thank you. She could not have been more effusive. What? That's good. It is fantastic. You just freaking lip. Oh my gosh. This is so good for you. And it's so good for us. Because but she literally just blew her up. And Evan, and Darcy is not in Kansas anymore. Or Iowa. Poor girl gets knocked around. Something feels like she adapts. She transforms. <laughs> what? Her feminine strength. Goodbye, Yellow Brick Road. And hello, Starlight. It's not me. I designed Homelander's suit. This is the microphobia. You're wrong. Oh, it's gosh. It's bold. It's bold. Edna. Where's Edna? It says you're confident in your own skin and you're not afraid to show it. Most importantly, it tells the story. What story? That belongs to them now. I have the right to choose how much of it I show. That is true. You do. You just won't be doing it in the seventh. I don't think... I feel like she's been bending and bending and bending. They're gonna bend her to the point where she's gonna break. Oh, we got pictures of her. She got the hand put the fuck you up. He's gonna want him next, ain't he? I know I would. You killed the love of my life. 
You gonna get got, sir. He's so fresh. He has he's been through so much. Never mind. Are we going somewhere? Yeah, for a while. Where? Nanya. Uh, I don't know. I spoke to Dr. Feldman. The pediatrician. He's still your doctor. And pediatrician. Someone you can you can talk to, help you, you know, get back to normal. There is no normal. Yeah, that's how to heal the body. I have never told you everything. I have never told you how much I hate sitting on that couch staring at the TV like we're already dead. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry, be careful. My father was a bipolar. <laughs> was a bipolar. One night when I was ten, he tried to smuggle me into the island to be with him. Whoa. Really? <laughs> what? What's wrong with you? Oh, hell no. All you're gonna do is lie and say how you're doing fine, and I'm gonna lie and pretend like I'm happy to see you. Why are you here? Nobody likes seeing him when he pops up. I'm a happy man now. Life is good. Monique is back. We're good. Just all you gotta do is piss on the ground every time your name comes up. Don't make me come out there. Well, this is God's work. <laughs> Don't make me come out there like a real parent. I'm a motherfucker with a heart. Now that's you. There's nothing there. You're just a motherfucker. Funny you should mention making a difference. Because we just dusted a server. Bullshit. Flames loose in here. How the hell did you do it? <laughs> I thought he didn't want to know nothing. A little liar. But before the talk. We cooked up a solid lead. They can check out the whole room as soon as they break. You can do homework. Is this going to Mother's Milk? Mallory shit. I ain't going to hang on this floor for a second. Mallory, on. what? Are you bringing Frenchie back? He's already there. can't work with that motherfucker. Eventually, now I ain't saying anything here. He lied! I heard Translucent's tracking chip went dead. You could be hurt. Uh, how? He's got diamond skin. He'll be fine. You did. <laughs> Those are your new talking points. Now this Why is he looking at the? He's gonna try to kill her baby, ain't he? Corporate wants to sell the shit out of us, huh? Yeah, I don't need these. Wow. You take care of your baby, and I'll take care of mine. Mr. Edgar wrote those hits, man. So if you want to go to eighty-two and take it up with him. Eighty-two. Yeah. He's gonna want to kill her baby. He's gonna kill her baby. You don't think this is conspicuous? Conspicuous? No, I don't think it's conspicuous. I think the big black van with fucking flowers on the side is conspicuous. It's gonna be Frenchie. Hey, Huey. Get your own motherfucker! But you ruined this guy! Oh, you give the game away! Not until this frog gets what's coming. I only thing that he's come in is me and your mother and titties! Frenchie! It is water under the bridge. You tell that to Mallory's grandkids. Tell them it's water under the bridge. Mallory's grandkids? Hey, Monique. Hold on. On my way home from work, I stopped by Deluca's, picked up two stacked tenderloins, then pulled by a mushroom. You got peanut on the west side? Yeah, baby. Come on in. <laughs> Fuck all of y'all, okay? You can have fucking joy. Now put the dash in. Huey? Nickname? No, my mother actually named me Mother's Milk. Did did she? <laughs> She's home. That's Papa, right? His name's Ruffy. Uh, you know the the rent? It was due last week. You have to check out those facts. Okay. <laughs> okay. But she ain't got no ass for real to look at. You know, we don't actually need to sneak in anything. Right? Like, all I need is your IPv6 number. Wow. 
Hello, man. We're with Brian and Audio Visual. We got the new router. He is coming in handy a lot more. And we can get you all the way up to a thousand Mbps. Thanks, thanks a lot. Okay. Come on in. That was simple enough. She likes herself. We're really big fans. I mean, Terminal Beauty three. She's an actress. Hey, let me know if you guys need anything else. Thank you. She, why is she, hold on. She's an actress and she's behind on her rent. Wow. You know how I fucked that all day? Good job. Yeah, get the job done, Huey. Let's go. Hmm. What is it? Nothing. What are you looking at? I know that's right. Good job, Huey. Well done. Ooh, excuse me, but you want an autograph? Or he don't remember what he looks like. Yeah. What the fuck, Huey? Haven't we met before? <laughs> Come on, man. Our meat is running out. Let's go. Let's get out of here. You trying to get us killed? Yeah. What the fuck, Huey? Go ahead, Maeve. Who do you guys think would win? Wonder Woman or Maeve? I think Wonder Woman would light her ass up. Yeah. Look, Transition's probably just lurking around a gynecologist's office or something. In two days? Come on. Oh, good gynecologist. Why are you concerned about this? Guys, you can't fucking stand Transition. Oh, team up? Of course. But if something's happened to him, then that's a direct attack on the Seven. Which is a direct attack on me. You've managed to make this about you in less than 20 seconds flat. <laughs> I like how they're casually like having this conversation. Captain, you guys are the real heroes. All right, sit tight. Elevators. Oh, she can't fly. Wonder Woman wins. Mr. Edgar wants us both at the race to blow a lighter for your chocolate machine. You know this. X-rayed Edgar, you know. I mean, he's close to a corner. <laughs> They're just people. But they snap their fingers and we jump. Why? Ooh, he wants the supers against regular humanity. Can we just cut to the part where you show up to the race anyway? Ooh. <laughs> See, that's why I love you. Girl power. Yeah, Why do you do all that? Did he crush his heart? That's nasty. What the fuck? You know the drill. Who shot at us first? Wow. Things I let you do to me. Yeah. I'm not even dating anymore. We used to, used to date. I mean, so you were him? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. the oh, the thing. Stillwell told me? If I don't win, I'm out. I'm out of here. Yeah. Oh, shit. I think I know who that is. Uh, Beyond your ability. Not what I would call a troll. No, I, I didn't mean to. He's a drug addict. I'm still trying to figure out who this is. How is that supposed to help me? I mean, I don't want to be some washed up bee squawk. You like me? Oh, I like this. You gotta watch what you say, sir. You gotta watch what you say. Come back to see you tomorrow after the race. No. What are you talking about? Are you kidding me? What? I mean, it was all cleared with Stillwell and everything. He lied? Look, our time is gonna come, I promise. He didn't. But I gotta get my leverage back first. What the hell 
Oh, it's not that, Nick. Sounds like some kind of performance enhancer. Steroid for sheep? Yeah, well, whatever it was, we just don't want another problem. I'm like, take it and don't come back. I would cut him off. Maybe it's because of seven. Might just be a school of manky roid heads. If we get a bit, can you work it out? Why? First of all, how do you get it? We gotta get somewhere. And how do they know how to find it? And who's who's making it? Is it the actual like people? You're a mild mannered reporter. So translucent, huh? He's a bad man. How the fuck did you pull that off? You press the button, and he went boom. In some ways, just right in that moment, it felt good. Oh, I knew it. Felt kind of good. Everything comes with a price. I like this character here, M.M. The price? Whatever it is, I'll pay it. Wow. Oh, look how sad she is. Nipple? He's in this movie too. Oh. Nope, she's in the outfit. If the people want us in the armed forces, the people can order Congress to do it. Am I right? Oh, wow. Yes! Making an entrance, as always. Cheer for my boy A Train! Cheer <laughs> for my boy A Train! I hope. <laughs> okay. Aren't you cute? <laughs> Is it okay if I get a selfie? Of course, honey. Take this. It's your old uniform, but I'm saving it for the new one. Hey, Starline, show us your dick. Sweetie, you know what? Save your money. I like that one much better. Starline, I need a minute. That lady will get on my damn nerve. Y'all, I feel like change should happen gradually. They're, they doing too much. Why do we have a breakout? Never mind if we not crack open that sludgy little chapter. If I ever really thought. For someone else, I just I don't think I can handle it. Oh my god, what is wrong with him? Yo, just think of a guy like that that's psycho that has superpowers. You're fucked. You're legit fucked. Rule number one don't ever date a soup. They got butt pads, and I don't know, I just feel like they got butt pads. Everybody loves thick in the bag, okay? Annie? Annie? Annie, hi. Huey? From the bench the other day? Frenchie, hurry the hell up! Fucking hell, Huey. You know stuff. <clears throat> it was really nice to see you, but I should get going. No, Huey, you need more time. Can I, uh, buy you an overpriced beer? Throw in some overpriced nachos? Either way. Look, a way to a girl's heart is through her belly. You know how they said the way to a man's heart is through, you know, from like cooking and stuff. We like to eat too. Must have eaten somewhere else. Let's fucking find a Frenchie. Obviously, it's not fair. I don't know if they really want you to be a hero. What? He, he turned his communicator off? It's quiet. Her mom. Just walk away. You ain't got nothing to say. She probably wants to be like the the change in the organization. I'll get back. You know, change it on, so from the inside. Me. I know you're you and everything, but if you ever just wanted to, you know, get... Would you like my number? He was trying to get there, but she volunteered it. But that's steps. I show your competition right there, A-Train. 
I'm, ooh, look at his lips. He is a little snack, ain't it? You look wide as hell. He must have shot up the place. We missed the boys. What's she doing? I'm out of here. I'll check in later. Is she sad? Is she about to dope herself up? Bro, what are you doing? You he, he can laser eyeball you. I wouldn't. I wouldn't stare at him like that. I probably have a mirror and be like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> all that for one lap. I didn't even need to take the drugs. He probably could have done his own. You get a number? No. Yeah. Out the window. Hey, man. Pop claws eyeballing a vial of V like it's made of Snickers. What, you think she next on A train stash? That's exactly what I'm saying. A train, how you celebrating tonight? Any special girl? Uh, what do you mean? <gasps> So it's a performance drug for you said it. super fans. You see that red case over there? I've been around long enough to know a fix kit when I see it. What? Hey, Bobka. Mr. Rose, sir. How's the car? Just give me a quick look at it. You can wait there if you want, but it's going to take me a few minutes to write the check. I don't bite. He said, give me my money. You could you see? Huh? No. Yes. I mean. <laughs> he liked the money better, baby. Yeah, it was a long time ago. Stop! In the name of the law! I am going to sit right here until the cops come. If you're a filthy pig who likes to eat ass. <laughs> I can't breathe. All right, all right, hold on. Bro, I just can't believe she fucked his face and then scratched his head with her freaking twat. Bro, she was riding his face till it exploded. Like you said, whatever the price you'll pay. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. We're gonna have this whole episode in this. I know where you're going, Dylan. Just tell us everything you know. Where's the fire? No, no, not fire. Water. Fucking porpoise found this at the bottom of the harbor. Oh, Jesus Christ. Is that from Ricky? Some kind of a maniac. Mm -mm. Not maniac. Hey, Deep. What can't I see? Zinc, Homelander. Correct. And what's the box made of, Deep? Zinc. Correct, again. <laughs> so they were just buying time. Coming for you. It was. They just declared war. Here we go! This show is absolutely not. <laughs> this is how I know I must have haven't been watching this damn shit. <laughs> this girl rode this man's face and then 
smothered him in, in, the, in the process and then crushed his head with her, her kitty cat. There was, there's a saying saying, thick thighs save lives. But them thighs took him, took him, took him straight to Jesus. Cause he, he, he didn't deserve that. He just came to get his damn check. All he wanted was his money, honey. And you gave him a little bit more than what he bargained for. Okay. Now I'm wondering how is, how is all of this going to, like, how, how is this going to work? How? How, how are they going to get her out of this pickle? Homelander is now on to the people that are coming for him. They found Translucent's body. We have Homelander now wanting to be a separate entity. He wants, because he's, he's a superhero. He's the strongest superhero. Why are they being directed by regular people who have no powers when he has all the powers and it's him, him, him? I also didn't like how he was talking to Maeve. Maeve seems like, I don't know how to feel about her character. I feel like for her, it's like, you can tell she's under pressure from the job. She doesn't want to lose her job. But I, I feel like there's a lot of, she's conflicted. Like her character seems to be conflicted. And I wonder why. I can tell it's probably because of Homelander, little weird, crazy ass. Um, the way he said, like if she found somebody or whatever like that, or. She, he, he couldn't take it. If if superpowers were a real thing, I don't think I would ever would want to date a superpowered person because of that that reason right there. They're, they'll what, come and kill me. I mean, anybody can go kill you, but they have more power. They're strong enough to do it and probably easier. And get rid of me. <laughs> Without anybody knowing. <laughs> this show is wild. Um, but yes, you guys, thank you for watching episode three with me, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. <laughs>